Cruz, the freshman, who the Tigers are very high on. Yeah, this kid out of Philadelphia, very strong. Shoots and scores, comes up the right, left side, goes down on his knees and fires it by the goaltender Feeney and the Tigers take a 1-0 lead. Yeah, he has a kid that probably Bucknell has no idea who he is. He's a uh, true freshman comes in uh, from Philadelphia. He's a hockey player. This kid's a strong guy. He's probably going to remind us of Bob Grieving, just being a tough kid, being able to come up. And that time he took the ball, goes point behind, and does his V cut coming back strong way. He gets up about a yard up, takes a hit, and throws that ball in on a nice bounce shot to the far corner. Charlie Streep out front, makes a move. To his right, throws it cross field, wind up shot and a score for Bucknell as Ryan Klipstein with the goal to tie it up at one apiece with 4.56 to go in the first quarter. Eisenreich over to the right side to Gansudis. Gansudis beats backwards, wind up shot and a score by Billy Eisenreich as he got free about 10 yards from the crease and stuck it in the bottom left hand corner. In the middle, wind up shot and a score for the Tigers and Christian Pesteric with his first goal as a Towson University Tigers and we're tied at two. Passes left side, wind shot, score again! This time, Carl Iacona, so the two transfers have combined for back-to-back -back goals. Pesteric from Cornell, Iacona from St. John's and the Tigers go up three to two. Right hand corner, onto a streaking shot and blocked by Billy Eisenreich is and then the rebound no, and he's, Wheeler no, he's be into says there was a man in the crease and that's yep. what happens. Stratton, Stratton feeds in the middle, shot, score, Tigers! The ball, he picks it up and it was a three on two. Harrington, wind, shoot, scores, top left hand corner. Five to two Tigers, Will Harrington with his first goal this season. He lobbed the ball to him almost 20 yards across field, and I see that Will Harrington, nobody's on him, and here comes the goalie just going, you gotta be kidding. 243 left in the first half. Matt Thomas facing off with Jake Clark, and Clark wins again. Thomas had it early on, but now the Bucknell Bison getting the face off. Feed down low, fast break, shot scored, Tim Brandow. Tigers never got settled on defense, and the Bison take advantage, and it's five to three. I'm sure Tony Seymour will be happy to go in at halftime with this lead of five to three, Greg. Stratton from the right, trying to make a move towards the crease. He feeds in front, shot, score, Tigers! Steve Norris, his first of the year, and Towson goes up six to three. This is what we want to see from Tim Stratton. We asked him to carry the ball this year. He gets the ball on the far side. It comes up strong left hand. He gets up about a yard or two above above the goal line extended, making sure that he's going to have a double team coming his way. Make sure that that defense has to slide his way. He rolls back, goes strong right, and throws it right up the uh, the lane. And you got Norris just curling out, looking a little bit like Jonathan Ingram, just popping out about like three, four yards off the crease, just catching it, going lower corner on the shot. Nice shot. Bad pass, ball loose, picked up by Bucknell. They're on a fast break, come down, shot, score, Bison. Feet over on the left, Danilishin comes in, shoots and scores. He got by one man, and that was Pete Mezzanotti, and was able to get within five yards of the crease, and Bucknell has cut it to one, six to five, with 9.34 to go in the third quarter. Mezzanotti tried to go with the home run check. Instead of going body, he goes over the head, and the, the midfielder just really, he beat him clean. He just ducked his stick down, went down low with it, Mezzanotti misses that check. And next thing you know, he's sitting six uh, yards ahead, and he's right inside on Wheeler. Coming down, shooting and scoring for Bucknell, Jason Niedhammer, and I think Wheeler thought he had the save, but the ball trickled off his leg into the left-hand corner of the goal, and we're tied. Thomas with a clear face off, he comes straight down. Thomas winds, shoots, scores! Beautiful. Boy, did we need that. Right off the face off, he popped it. It was a, as you called it, it was a it was a different face off man. He just caught that, he popped it forward, and he was off to the races. They let him come down, he got inside. I think it was about eight yards out. We're gonna look at that 
uh, you know, the Tiger vision up there on the goal. I think he's about eight yards out, and he just let it go. Opposite stick side, he goes top shelf. Right there, yep, he had that shot going opposite stick side. Look at the streak, he winds, shoots off the right pipe, ball bounces out, picked up, feed down low, all alone, Brandau for the goal. Shot comes Tied at seven. Shot comes from street from out far, and he hits the pipe, and ricochets out about 15 yards out. Out defense just fell and looked at the ball, and they didn't look behind, and Brandau just stands on the back, back side, right open on the crease. Passes back to his left to Britain. Britain wide, shoot, scores! You know, you just can't back off. A big, uh, big time shooter as Britain is, he just let him get his arms extended. Feed back behind to Hughes. Hughes in front, shot, score, Tigers! This Matt Hughes is so Tim patient. Stratton with his first of the day. Very, very patient offense. As I was just saying, I was on patient enough that I was thinking that, you know, a stall warning could have come out of it. Penny <laughs> got better out there. Uh, so Feed inside and a goal by Tim Brandau as he got loose on the crease, yeah. and he makes it a 9-8 ball game with 10.06 to go. Gansudis. Gansudis behind the goal to Brandau. He's the guy you got to watch. Brandau moving in, fires, shoots, scores, we're tied at 9. And wanted to shoot, and all we can have is just body-to-body -body pressure from Lally, and this kid's a shooter. Play with it, Alex Lyons feeds ahead, one-on-one -on -one shot, score streak, 10-9, Bucknell with 6.37 to go. We got it, what we're gonna do? No, they're waving it off! Yep, we got all Offsides, on. Bucknell! Move towards the crease, feed, down low, Brandau shoots, scores, 10-9, Bucknell. By Danilisson, he comes in, he shoots and scores, 11-9 Bucknell with a minute 49 to go. So a full break with core, this is Spiro Marinkus. The final score is Bucknell 13, Towson 9 until tomorrow afternoon. Have a pleasant Saturday.